you cannot tax billionaires on the shares that they hold in a company because it is an unrealized gain, right? So they go like, yeah, you, you're worth 300 billion, but we can't tax you on the, the, those stocks because you haven't sold the shares, so you don't like have the money, right? But you're worth the money, but you don't have the money, so you can't tax the people on a thing because they, they don't have it. It's just there. Okay, fine. <laughs> then Elon Musk offers to buy Twitter, right? He offers to buy it, and then he says, in his offer, he goes, I'm putting up my Tesla stock as collateral. Then I'm like, so you, you do have it. <laughs> then I'm going like, wait, wait, so, so you, you, can, you can buy a thing based on what you have, yes. But when we want to tax you, you can say, I don't have it. <laughs> do, do, do you hear what I'm saying here? And now... Like, just, just, just think of like the illogic of it. It's like it's such a fun game that like billionaires get to play because all their money is in that, right? Like, like if you earn your money as a salary, that your money just gets taxed. That's it. You can't be like, like the IRS comes and you can't be like, I don't have that money. You can't be like, that money's in the bank. I don't have that money. What money? It's in the bank. Only when I take it out, then you can tax me. For now, it's in the bank, IRS. No, IRS is like, don't worry. We've got your PIN number. We'll handle this, right? But then, if you have billions in shares, you can then use that as money to then get more money, but not get taxed on any money because you don't have money.